Welcome to an unboxing of Black Angel. And this is a board game that's been on my um, wish list for a long time. And um, end of year sale at Good Games. I was able to pick it up. Very excited to get this. This is a board game for one to four players, 12 and above, 60 to 120. So one out of two hours um, playing. And without further ado, let's have a look. It's a heavy box. It is quite big, so let's have a look and see what's inside. Some of the scissors. Nothing quite like fighting your way through the wrapping. First thing that hits me is the really fantastic art. The, um, the pictures you see reviews the don't do it justice. It is very attractive. Hard to get into the box. Okay. okay, let's have a look. Alright, so we have got component list, instructions, introduction, overview. That's always handy to have a bit of a layout. Rules, very colourful. And do we have a summary on the back? No, we don't. Okay, well, there's a variant playing solid here, so that's handy because that's the way I'm going to be playing it. Two player game, advanced rules. Okay. Appendix. Oh, okay. This is handy. This has got summaries for. This is looking complex. Oh. Like a bit of challenge. Oh, here we go. This is a, um, a kind of like a reminder card. Let's have a look. This is what I was kind of looking for in the rules. So, this is your turn sequences um, and your set of actions for the four players. So, that's going to be really handy when I play solo because I'll have one up each way. And that's a nice summary. So, very much appreciated. Thank you very much. And then we've got a board, and I've got a feeling this is just going to be massive. Okay, so that's that's really thick cardboard too, so that's really high quality. Um, I've got it on the wrong way. It's single sided, but um, that's the board. Wow, and that's really. What else we got? So we've got sets of tokens, and that looks like a control panel. Again, I get more of the board. This is thicker card than I'm used to in most of my board games. That's good. Oh, I guess these are the four players. I would imagine that these are the, without reading the rules, these would be four player. So that was a red one, a blue one, a purple one, and a pink one. So these will be for the players um, and tokens to pop out. Here we've got on more of the board structure. These look like alien races. If you like tokens, this will be a game for you. There's a lot of tokens. And two more. Three more. I guess I could. What we have? Quick look. Oh, okay, so they joined together to make the space board. So that's what these things are. So that's your shipboard, your space board, and then your player board, and it joins together. Go need a lot of room on the table. And even more. Are they double sided? Yes, they are. So there's probably a level of randomization in there, depending on how you stick them down. And even more. Okay, that's good. Oh, dice. I like dice. Yeah, they look interesting. So let's have a look. look into here. So, oh yeah. 
filled, not too heavy. Good, good dice. So we've got some sets of dice. We've got these look like little crystals. Um, tokens. I guess those are player tokens. I would guess four players, four different colours. This reminds me of Terraforming Mars. So these are like um, status status cubes. Yeah, so they're plastic status cubes, damage tokens if you like playing Nemesis. And what else we got? We've got a lot of bags, which will be handy for bagging things up. There's a lot of bags in here. And we've got Oh yeah, these are like your little robot meeples. So little white robots, blue, pink, and orange. Ah, oh, these look like little stands. Okay, so this is gonna be fun. So we'll get a stand. And then we probably do that. There we go. Oh, that's cute. There's going to be lots of... I think the board's going to look really great when it's got all the components on it because these are really nice little plastic components that we join together. This uh, is probably the front of the ship. It's called as the frigate figurine. This is the Black Angel. There we go. So this is probably moving on the, on the space board. So that's a nice detailed it's plastic well oh okay and there's a stand oh, okay so it'll be the stand for the um you're gonna end up with a lot of little bags this will be for the space this will be for the ship Traveling, I imagine, down one of these. Good play. Okay, so that's nice. And we've got some sets of cards. Oh, nice little inserts. So we've got a lot of little cards. How many have we got? 60 mission cards, 20 of each color. Um, 30 Ravager cards, 20 starting technology tiles. Okay. Nicely laid out, good color schemes. It's on the outside. And I imagine this will make perfect sense once I've read through the rules and followed through. The red ones are the Ravager cards. Let's have a look in here. Mm -hmm. So these are the yellow, the yellow ones. Mission cards. So there's four different colors of mission cards, yellow, green, and gray. And then the red ones are the Ravager cards, whatever they are. They don't sound too friendly though. No, they don't look too friendly. They look like aliens. These are quite small cards. Um, but look at that. Magic card, um, literally half the size, just just under the magic card, is about 83. So I'd say these are 40-ish by 60, thereabouts. I think I'm just leaving them. 
imagine that's why we've got these bags. There's a lot of them. I can't overkill on the bags. But then, sometimes that's handy so that you can get things ready for them. Um, I often um, strip out everything that isn't relevant for solo or co-op and um, bag that all up because I'm not going to be using it. I haven't looked at the rules for this yet, but I've heard some very good things, which is why it was on my wish list. Um, and I was very excited to pick it up and good games in Newcastle. And if you're in Newcastle, and it's still this week, um, get to be a society. And I'm just going to swivel back in the box. So it looks like it's got, so what do we get? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you get lots of, lots of tokens, lots of good components. That's why the box is so heavy. Junky board. And um, reference sheets, which are always appreciated. Colourful rules, and the rules aren't too big. It's only 16 pages with credits, so it looks like it's only about 13 pages of rules, of which the first three. So you're probably only looking at that setup, so you're only really looking at about six pages of rules. So there you go. That is Black Angel. Um, very much looking forward to getting that on the table soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe um, and tune in for more unboxings.